In this video, let us understand how to write the program to find area of 3D shapes. So this is the area of 3D shapes. So what is 3D? So 3D, it will have three dimension. Okay. So this is Y, this is X and this is Z. X, Y, Z. So here we will write the program to find the area of cube, cone, prism, sphere, even cylinder, pyramid. This is a cuboid. Okay. So square if you extend then it becomes a cuboid. Pyramid. So you have a base and you will have a pointed joint on the top. This is a pyramid. So the important thing is uh, previously we have video to find the area of 2D shapes. Area of 2D shapes. So please watch that video. So therefore you will get a clear picture of like how to calculate the area of the shapes. Now in case of 3D, the important thing is the formula. We should know the formula for to calculate the total area. In case of cube, it is 6a square. In case of rectangular prism, is 2 into WL into HL into HW, where L is a length, W is a width, H is a height. In case of cylinder, so which one is cylinder? So you can see that here is a cylinder, right? So to find the cylinder, what is the formula? I can take here. Okay, fine. So this cylinder 2 pi r bracket r plus h. r is the radius, h is the height of the cylinder. In case of cone, here is a cone, the first one, cone. <coughs> pi r bracket r plus l. r is the radius, l is a slant height. Sphere, pi r square. m is sphere, 3 pi r square. So like that for each the corresponding formula, you have to use the formula to calculate the area. I will show this, how to make a program for the same. As I said already, previously we have already done the video for to check for area of 2D shapes. So please watch that video, it is a detailed video. So check it out in our list, you go to iBlix tutorials, videos. And uh, here you can check uh, this is a hash PPE 115. So that video is a 115. So please watch that video. You will get a complete idea how to write a complete program for the 2D shapes. We will use the same program and let us modify it to find the 3D shapes. So here is the previous program as I said. So here we have four functions. One is area of circle. So now I will change to cube. This one to cube. Right. So in case of cube, you need to take the enter the length. So when you take the length, so in case of cube, it's six a square. So therefore six. So a square or a square. So s into s. So this is area of cube. Next one, we will consider area of cylinder. In case of cylinder, we will take R and the H. So R is the radius. So this is R. The formula is 2 pi that is 3.14 into R uh, into R plus H. Uh, 
or this multiplied with the this one. Multiply all this into multiply with this. Now let us run the program and you can see that here are the choices. So first one I will take as a cube. Then last for the length. So the length is 8 centimeter. So then I will give the total area. Total surface area of the cube is 384. Now you can enter the choice for sphere that is 4. I will ask for the radius. So say 5 centimeters is the radius. Then I will give total sphere area is 82.5 square centimeters. So likewise, so if I give the option 5, you need to exit. So I will exit from the program. Fine. So as I said, please watch the previous video. There we return the complete program. Here we modify the program. So here there are four functions. One is to find the cube. Second one to find the area of cylinder. So this one is to find the area of the cone. And uh, next one area of sphere. And to call the all options, okay, you want to provide the menu options. So this is the options here. While true, you can choose any one option. So based on the choice, we will have if condition here, we will call that particular function. So the function which is already written here will be called. So please try this program. So let us know what you feel and if you have any difficulty, please put it in the comment box. Let me know that. Thank you.